Ladies and gentlemen, what is up and what's going down as my chair squeaks in the intro. We're back with another episode of NBA 2K17 Drafting Champions. This time we will be drafting 7th overall. And if you don't know what this series is about by now, you guys, uh, you probably didn't watch the previous episodes. But I will give you a little gist of what's going on. We pick a random team, which will be the Boston Celtics, apparently. We'll pick that random team. We will go and kind of just choose a selection slot we went from 10th down to 9th 8th and we're gonna now pick at 7th and we're gonna keep on doing this until we get to first or until we win a championship something i've never done in 2k is win a championship by only using the draft and then simulating so we can't trade we can't pick up free agents there are no injuries so that's what i'm saying that's what it's all about let's get started i'm gonna go with anthony Davis, one of the most powerful, most interesting players to take because he could play center, he could play power forward, I don't know. However this draft works out, that's what I'll go with. But I'm really tempted to take Kevin Love, but Mike Conley, if he's available, I usually take him because he outperforms his value in the draft. I don't know why, but he does it all the time, and I'm really considering between Brook Lopez and Vucevic, but I always go with Brook. I love taking Brook Lopez, but I'm gonna go with Vucevic this time, and hopefully it works out for us. But Kent Bazemore, Luol Deng, I'll take Luol Deng just because of that defense. And uh, yeah, I think I'll go with JJ Redick. All out three point option. He's gonna be great for us, setting those, uh, what's it called? Getting those cuts off of screens which will be useful, and we'll see how it works out from here. But Trevor Ariza, 3 and D kind of guy, let's go and take that boy and put him in the roster. Now, I honestly think that Darren Williams will be a good choice for us, lead that back up uh, the bench, be that backup point guard that we need, and uh, hopefully it works out for us. But now, I really had a tough decision between Jordan Hill and Festus Azili. My boy, hey, it's Ray, loves Jordan Hill, and he's still available, but I'm still not going to take him. We got Festus Azili, and then I'm going to take Channing Fry just for that three-point oomph, and hopefully it works out well. But last but not least, I don't think this is the last guy, but I'm going to go and pick some random people. I'm going to take Jordan McRae because I might need that scoring in the playoffs. Who knows? But uh, Seth Curry, let's go and take this boy as well, and that should do it for us. We have our last pick, I think, or maybe we have two more, I don't know. But I'm gonna go and take that guy right there, you know who it is, Shaq to the Fool Champion, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm gonna go and take Jason Terry as the last pick, that's gonna do it for us, I promise. And here's how our team stacked up, there you go, we got JaVale McGee, who's actually doing pretty good. Doing pretty good on that Warrior squad, not gonna lie, if, they, if the Warriors are smart enough to, to start that boy, Woo he things are gonna get crazy, but we are off to a great start five and two six and two Okay, I'm liking it. I'm liking it now. We're not gonna do any of that stuff. That is beyond Blasphemy to do that in a series like this and as I said before we're gonna disable the CPU trade offers Because no sir not today. That isn't what we do. This isn't how we play hashtag bars. Let's go now Okay, all right I like our standing, 35 and 20. We're beasting, we're feasting, we're doing great things. Trade deadline, no, we're not waiting for that. Let's see how we roll. Now let's go and check out how we did. I don't think we'll have anybody in here, so this isn't too important right here, but you're just gonna go and check that out. And I do wanna see who's in it for us. There you go, Anthony Davis. Oh yeah, let's go, okay. But there you go, those are the rest of the people. Anthony Davis made the all-star team, which is impressive because that kind of shows you how well he's doing in the season. And Westbrook, MVP, which is uh, expected. One of those expected things. Ben Simmons, rookie of the year, you injured boy. Joe Kim Noah, okay, defensive, six man, okay. Carl Anthony Towns, defensive and most improved, which is wow. Considering his rookie season, still getting that most improved. Steve Kerr with 51 wins, getting Coach of the Year. Of course, it's the Warriors. Russell Westbrook, John Wall, LeBron James, Kevin Durant, Carl Anthony Towns, first team All-NBA. Damian Crisp, George Griffin, and whoever that was. 
But there you go, all NBA third. There's Anthony Davis. Carl Anthony Towns on that defensive team, which is kind of surprising. Beating out Andre Drummond? DeAndre Jordan? No, sir, not in real life. There you go, and we get that fourth seed. Here's how everything turned out. Westbrook led the league in scoring. And uh, James Harden doing well for Ev. I think he got eight assists per game. James Harden is going beast mode. He's going ape. Anthony Davis, though, put it in that work. 20 points a game scorer. And uh, that's all we really got in the top 10 for the league. Here's how our team stacked up. JJ Redick did nice with it. And Vucevic, Anthony Davis cleaned up the boards. Assist per game. Mike Conley, look at that. 13 and 8. Pretty much 13 and 9. He outdid it. And then he got 2.1 steals. And he led the team in turnovers. <laughs> but let's go and get started to the real part of the series. Let's go simulate that game. Okay, Toronto, do you understand what you're doing? You're messing with the Boston Celtics. And forget about it. That's a horrible accent. I'm not going to do that again. Forget about it. It's horrible. I did it again, and I don't know why I did it. But we lead the series 3-1. Let's go. Okay, I'm loving it. Okay, we, we can't stall like that. We can't mess around. Don't give them hope. Toronto doesn't need hope. They already have snow, something I'm jealous about. I wish it snowed here in San Francisco, okay? I don't have snow. I love snow. S Toronto has snow. Don't give them any more hope. We end up with a victory. Conley, bro. Bro. <laughs> Sounded like a turkey. Bro. <laughs> but Conley did work. 23-6 and 9. Devin Booker as well. Let's go to that second round. We're going up against the Cavaliers. Let's do it. I honestly think we can beat these Cavs. The eighth seed Cavaliers beat the number one Philadelphia 76ers. You know it's 2K when, when the Sixers are the number one seed and the Cavs are number eight, okay? Okay. Anyways, this is going to be easy peasy lemon squeezy. Hashtag bars. 3-1 again, and hopefully we can close it out right here. Let's do it. Let's go. Simulate that game. Come on, Boston. Let's go. It's a rivalry. Don't make it last any longer. Get that rest. Come on. Blowing them out here in a closeout game. I wonder who's going to be the guy that really just shines for us this series. Come on. You can do it. Come on. That's it. That's the game. Celtics come out on top against the Cavaliers. Conference Finals, here they come. Anthony Davis, but Mike Conley, man. He kind of... Took a step back as Anthony Davis shined in this one. Austin Rivers. What happened to Carl Anthony Towns? He did nothing. But let's go. We're going up against the Brooklyn Nets. Okay. Who would have thunk that Brooklyn would be in the conference finals and get a victory? Simulate another one. Oh, messed up. Okay, simulate that. Okay, Brooklyn. Getting two victories. Let's go for that third one. What? Who's on this team? Who's on the team? James Harden, Drew Holiday, Cam Bazemore, Serge Ibaka, Jonas Valanciunas. You know what? It's got to be Cam Bazemore. <laughs> we passed up on him in the draft, and he's like, I'm going to make you pay. I'm going to make you pay. Come on. At least get a victory. Oh, my goodness. Brooklyn is all out beasting right now. And they got Valanciunas and Ibaka. It looks like they're countering our guys, our main two, two guys down low. Anthony Davis doesn't seem to be able to figure out what's happening. Just play some offense. We get eliminated in a blowout, in a sweep. This is the closest we've ever been to winning a championship, and this is how it ends. Ah! I really, really want to win. This is the closest I've ever been. No joke, JJ Reddick carried us. But look at that, Mike Con What in the world? Anthony Davis. 7 points, 3 of 19. Mike Conley, 4 of 14. <sighs> I'm really mad. Drew Holiday, James Harden, Jonas. The Triple J. Illuminati confirmed. Oh my goodness. Lakers, Brooklyn. It could have been Celtics, Lakers. This would have been the perfect way to end a series. No joke. Paul George just did it. 
carry the team. This dude is clutch. In 2K, he is one of the best players you could take. If he's available in the draft, take him. But these are the playoff performers. JJ Redick averaging 13. I thought he'd average more considering what he did for us in games. Anthony Davis only 17. He is not clutch, apparently. Don't trust on Anthony Davis in the playoffs. He will not get it done. But that's going to do it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really, really do want to win one. And once we get that one, I'm going to end the series because I want to end on a high note. But thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Adios.